Well, as we enter into the new year, many people are attempting the new year, new me resolution with many trying to get in shape, but finding it hard to accomplish. News 19's Walker Lawson looks at why the healthy lifestyle is more mental than physical and how to make it happen. Making the decision for a healthier lifestyle at the beginning of the year is a resolution that many want to accomplish, but find it hard to keep. Jennifer Wolf, owner of JJ Wolf Counseling, says there needs to be a strong mental preparation in order to accomplish a physical process. Slow and steady wins the race, so to speak, and that it's a it's a it's a slow um, process. Don't set unreal. Goals. When setting those goals, most people are typically only looking to lose weight or to get in better shape. But Wolf has noticed in her clients, a healthier diet and lifestyle leads to a stronger mind. The mind is connected to the body and the two cannot be treated separately. So whatever, however you're caring for your body is going to directly correlate. Columbia residents like Mary Walter Creech and Brian Dye have noticed the mental pros that come from a healthier lifestyle. It's really good for my mental health and anxiety. Uh, mind functions better, feel sharper, uh, feel healthier. This type of lifestyle is helpful to many, but with the recent rise of COVID cases, it can prohibit people from accomplishing those goals. It can be a mindset of, okay, I can't go outside, I can't, so I'm just going to be sedentary. But people like Mark Austin have found a solution for that. I have some equipment at home, you know, so when I don't feel like, you know, leaving or whatever. Wolf has one final tip to those attempting the change. When you figure out the why and you embrace that, then the how will become much easier. Wolf stresses being healthy is not just a New Year's resolution, and when someone is mentally ready to do it, they can. In Columbia, I'm Walker Lawson, News 19, WLTX. Well, for recommendations on what a healthy lifestyle is for you, you should always consult with your doctor first for tips and advice.